After a good night's sleep and a hearty breakfast, we jumped into the truck and were heading to our next stop, but first we wanted to take in the scenic beauty of the Manistique Lighthouse located right in downtown Manistique. This North Shore community is blessed with all the moods of Lake Michigan and today it was showing its temperamental side. The winds were howling and the snow blowing in every direction as the waves crashed to shore. Is there anything more beautiful? If there is, I haven't seen it. I spent a few minutes here before Denny reminded me I had things to do and places to go. We've been here before but never in the winter and it is an adventure that has me excited and anxious to get started. It's called the Environmental Lab and Interpretive Trail. We asked local motel owner Dennis Jankowski if he would like to accompany us on the snowshoe trip because we knew he had moved to the UP just a few years ago from downstate Michigan and was always looking for a new UP adventure. To start the trip, we met at Dennis's Holiday Motel, located right on US 2 just before you arrive in Manistique. We didn't stay here on this trip, but we will next time. It is finished off in knotty pine and all the rooms have handmade log and pine furniture. It looks like northern Michigan and has the amenities you want like wireless internet without giving up the feel that is uniquely the UP. Oh yeah, and it's located right across the road from the Kuwait and Casino. So play outside all day and play inside all night. Now you got the traditional sign. I'm going to be wearing the aluminums and uh, it doesn't matter what kind you've got. Now we're both going to be using poles today. Just it just makes it a little bit easier, I think. Sure. And uh, we'll go out and try these trails. Uh, we got a nice uh, fresh uh, topping of snow here. How much did we end up getting? Beautiful. Do you know? I don't know, three, four inches last night. So it's uh, it's pretty good. And yeah. uh, I think that uh, the time's right and we ought to get into the woods and uh, try it out. Let's go. Okay. We have more information on the environmental lab on our site along with the only known map. We copied this from the trailhead so that you could print a copy before you go. Just go to www.greatgetaways.tv. You'll find everything from today's show to help you have a great getaway. You know, Dennis, one of the things I like about this part of the trail is it's going to take us right along this ridge and we can look out across this view right here, which is just beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Boy, what a great day to be out here. But it uh, should be a good trail. Most of the trail up here that we're going to go on is pretty flat, with the exception if we decide to go down. And I don't know what that would be like today, uh, traveling up and down hills on snowshoes. But, yeah, well, maybe we'll give it a try. What do you think? Try. All right, let's, let's head on over to the trail. In the 1995 press release on the just finished project known as the Environmental Lab stated that it was a partnership project with the help of hundreds of volunteers including the Schoolcraft County Natural Resources and Agricultural Focus Group. The property for the 80 acre lab was donated by Manistique Township. The Environmental Lab's purpose was for the environmental education of youth. The property is located within three miles of most of the county's schools and contains a wide variety of flora, fauna, topography, soils, and stages of succession. Three state and federal grants supported by local donations to match have allowed the project to develop and be successful. It was like a fantasy forest and we stopped for a minute to enjoy it. You know, I can't get over uh, how beautiful this is out here and actually how much snow we've got. Uh, a lot of people come into Manistique during the winter? Yeah, yeah, we, we do get a lot of uh, visitors in the, in the winter, absolutely. Um, we've, got, uh, we've got the same kind of trails as, uh, as they have farther north in, uh, around Lake Superior, Munising, um, but it's just a little bit uh, shorter drive for people coming from downstate. And uh, I understand there's probably eh, a little bit uh, more inexpensive a lot of times to uh, stay down here along the shoreline too. Absolutely, if you're... Uh, you know, if you're a snowmobiler and, and the big crowds are up in Munising, it's just as easy to stay in Manistique, save yourself a few miles of drive time, and get on your sled and head north. Yeah, and I know a lot of people say, there's more snow up there, but I'll tell you what, we're getting plenty of it oh, here. we plenty of snow here. <laughs> what do you say we head on down the trail if we can continue to find it here? <laughs> In 1996, we took a hike through the environmental lab with a good friend, Chris Corey. Well, how times have changed. 
It looks like it's been a lot of years since anyone has even hiked this beautiful area. Fallen trees and aging signs and resting seats are all in the last stage of their usefulness. Now it was like a new discovery and in the winter even more beautiful to behold. Just take a look and imagine you are here. It's peaceful and tranquil and you will never want to leave. The Environmental Lab is one of those places that we talked about earlier in the show that the only place you'll find information about it is on our website. It was not even known by most of the local residents that we talked to. Well, we uh, have come back up from uh, the boardwalk that took us down the, uh, down the hill and out uh, into the uh, lowlands out there. And uh, great little adventure going out there. A great trail that's up here. We just did a portion of this trail that goes on down that way and then loops out around and goes back uh, to where we started at. And there are some cut across trails. As a matter of fact, there's one that starts right here that cuts across so you can shorten it up a little bit. Dennis, what'd you think of the trail? A lot of work, but uh, a lot of fun too. Um, beautiful scenery. Um, hey, there's nothing like winter in Manistee. Oh, hey, you got that right. And it's a good place for everyone to come up here. Come on up, give it a try. Dennis knows where this is at. He can point you in the right direction. You can come out here and enjoy it.